look at the state of me. At least I've got clean hair. I don't know what's going on with my fringe at the moment. This is what we're working with. Anyway, good morning, welcome back. It's Friday, the 14th of April, 2023, and it is pouring down. Um, I'm on day three of headache, so not enjoying that. My Avon order eventually arrived day before yesterday. Um, I gave my daughter the thing that she wanted, the face cream, sunscreen. <laughs> Bear with. Um, I also got myself this, which I really like. Obviously, I like the... Um, <clears throat> see, this is a headache brain. Uh, cleansing balm that I'm using at the moment, number seven one. But every now and again, I like to use something different, and I really like this one. This is the Cannabis Sativa Oil Cleanse and Calm Transforming Oil to Milk Cleanser from Avon. So that's really good. Um, and then I wanted to try their new mascara, Lash Genius Multitask and Multiply Mascara. So I'm going to try that one this morning. And then I got to make up the order to I get free delivery. I got a couple of uh, hand wash, sweet and joyful hand wash. I can't smell. Secret Lagoon hand wash. Right. I really thought when I went to bed last night, I was like, I'll wake up in the morning and I'll feel better. But no, unfortunately not. Never mind. Um, tonight, my eldest son and his girlfriend are coming for the weekend. I'd like it to say it's to see us, but actually it's because he wants to go to a football match. <laughs> but um, yeah, it'd be nice to see him. And then Sunday I've invited my other son and his girlfriend round as well, so we'll have a nice family day. So I'm looking forward to that. But first, I need to get myself ready for work, get myself motivated and get in the shop. I've actually had two better days. It's been dreadful for the last two weeks, the shop takings, but I've had two better days. So fingers crossed, it's the start of things. <laughs> I showed you when I got these two that I'd picked up the highlighter by mistake but I got this blusher I thought that looks quite sort of rosy pink look how bright it is wow <laughs> you can tell I know what I'm doing <laughs> right shall we try this mascara why do they make it so difficult to get into oh it's gold that looks nice doesn't it looks special. Let's see what sort of applicator, is that what you'd call it? So that's the... Move my hair. Yeah, quite like that. I've been using this one. I find it a little bit gloopy. I end up with it all everywhere. So this feels less, less gloopy, which is good for me anyway. Lash genius. I think I'm gonna just dry my fringe and then I might even cut it. I don't think my hairdresser cut it as short as she normally does and it just, I don't know, it just won't do anything this time. Let's give it a go.
I'm in the shop and I cut my fringe. I think you can't notice it too bad. I haven't like done it totally at angle, so we're all right. Um, it's pouring with rain, so I've not taken Jenny out this morning. <clears throat> Neither of us like the rain. Um, hopefully it's gonna ease off this afternoon and then either my husband or my daughter will take her out later. Uh, I've got the dress on that I got in the two order. Um, yeah, I've had to put a cardigan over the top. Yesterday I was freezing, I had jeans on, about three or four tops, and then that uh, burgundy sort of cord shirt. And I was still really, really cold all day. Um, but I don't think I've been quite quite right this week. I've had headaches and last night I was feeling sick, so I don't quite know what's up with me. Um, and then I also kept the burgundy t-shirt. So they were the two things that I kept from that two order. Right, I'll get the shop open and see if there's any customers around. Have I left that bit a bit longer? Oh, I think I'll get away with it. It's a little bit windy, so I'm gonna wait and put my blinds out a bit later. I think it's supposed to ease off, so I'm gonna wait an hour or so, or maybe half an hour anyway. First things first, get my wax melt going. Um, I've had pomegranate, oh, I can't speak. Pomegranate noir this week. It's been very, very nice. I've had some compliments, so that's good. Um, plans for today, I've got a few little things to pack. Oh, I've got to do some research. Hang on a second. I got this from a customer yesterday. So it's copper with pewter sort of inlaid there. There is like a mark, looks like H M. Sorry, I was trying to remember what it said. And then on the back, it says egg tube. I Googled this, nothing came up. Um, so yeah, interesting. I'll have a little bit of research on that today. One of the jobs I did this week <clears throat> um, was I put some gnomes on my website. So if you wanted to have a look, the little ones like this, that size are eight pounds. Uh, I particularly like this one. Look, he's got a little blue bird. Isn't that lovely? He's called Paul. <laughs> um, and then the bigger ones, like this size, are 15. He's called Cheeky for some reason. Um, the only one I haven't put on is the fishing one because it's a little bit awkward with the fishing rod and I kind of like would prefer people to see it in person rather than order it over the website. Um, and he's cute with a really big hat, isn't he? He's called Toasty. And then I also put one of the toadstool things on as well, like that. And they're made of resin. They're, they're new things, you know. Um, so yeah, I'm pleased with that. It's another addition to my website. Um, but apart from that, I haven't been all that productive because I haven't been feeling 100%. So it's kind of just get through the day. I've just put my blinds out, but I'm not putting anything else out yet. I'm going to wait a little bit longer. I thought I'd do it in stages today, I think. Um, because the last thing I want is to be chasing stock or signs down the road. <laughs> I'm really looking forward to this weekend. I've got my eldest coming tonight and he's staying until Sunday. Then my other son's coming over on Sunday. My daughter's still here, or she is out tonight, so, and it's a friend's, two, two of her friend's birthdays, so it might be a late one and she might be feeling a little bit crocky tomorrow. Um, and then on Monday, I'm meeting Caroline in Exeter, hopefully, as long as we're both feeling all right. So, yeah, really looking forward to this weekend. I love these two.
it's about quarter past one and I had a really quiet first couple of hours but I've just had a good hour so that is nice it's nice to actually take some money and feel like I'm achieving something at the end of the day I sold one of these they're like little insect hotels so one of those go went and also a seahorse which I think was the last one of these sort of um fair trade seahorses that I'd got so that's good sold some earrings I sold what else did I sell some art art materials um a clock that didn't work I got a pound for it's amazing what you can sell I just put the kettle on feel the need for a coffee um and uh it's gone quiet again now I just had one of my favorite customers in she's so lovely she's 86 and um she has got mobility issues but she tries not to let it get the better of her and she tries to get out and about and she's always so positive and so lovely and she was talking about her sons and she said I'm so blessed I have the most lovely sons I don't know why I'm so blessed and I said it's probably because they're blessed with you as a mother <laughs> and she was just like looked at me really a bit bemused <laughs> I have to admit that I completely forgot that I was vlogging today. I've just been getting on with things. Um, I haven't really got anything else to show you, so I'm going to say thank you very much for watching. I'd love a thumbs up, and if you can leave a comment, that really helps with the algorithms. Take care, stay safe, and I'll see you soon.